The city of Chicago is moving ahead with its plan to house migrants at the old Wadsworth School in Woodlawn. The shelter's opening was delayed last week after neighbors said they were not taken into consideration. City officials say they're overwhelmed by the number of people arriving from the border and there's no other place to house them. The Wadsworth shelter will open in two weeks. Organizers are promising 24-7 security, but many residents still are not pleased. I am, to say the least, freaking appalled at this fiasco. You're helping other countries. Why don't you help the people that need it here? Tell Mayor Lightfoot she will not get my vote again. City officials say the school should be used as a shelter for the next two years. Mayor Lightfoot admits a mistake was made in contacting CPS teachers to recruit student campaign workers. The issue is likely to follow her on the campaign trail. Eric is live on the near south side with more. Eric? Well, good morning. The mayor will be at the annual MLK Interfaith Breakfast here this morning, where she will likely be happy to talk about everything but emails. Mayor Lori Lightfoot says it was a mistake for emails sent from her campaign to CPS teachers asking for students' help in exchange for school credit. But while admitting a mistake, she didn't necessarily take responsibility. It was a mistake. It was a young person who was enthusiastic, well-intentioned, but she made a mistake. Lightfoot says the young staffer's mistake wasn't in trying to engage young people to get involved in the election process. Engaging young people in a political campaign is something that is routinely done. The line that was crossed that should not have been crossed is Googling, finding CPS emails and then reaching out to teachers. Her long list of challengers condemned her actions, calling it unethical. The Chicago Teachers Union also chiming in, saying not only does it cross ethical lines, but violates state and federal election laws. It's surprising um, and really disappointing that they ever thought that this was all right and that they initially attempted to defend it. The mayor says she didn't know anything about the emails until Wednesday. By then, her campaign had issued several statements defending the move. She also says that this wasn't the first batch of emails to educational institutions that went out looking for campaign help. What I'm aware of is one other time in August, um, right before school started, uh, where she did a similar thing and um, reached out to a wide array of folks to say, hey, there's this internship uh, opportunity available. After getting the emails, the city colleges of Chicago notified the campaign of its ethical guidelines and no further emails have been sent. The mayor says a lot of lessons have been learned. We emphasize to her and to other people in the campaign, I'm not just some candidate, I'm the mayor um, and responsible uh, for uh, the schools and this is the kind of outreach that never should have happened. Now, CPS has opened up an investigation. A number of city council members would also like to see an investigation. Mayor Lightfoot said that she would fully cooperate with all investigations. We are live on the near south side of Maricron, WGN News.